Hello everyone and welcome to a new episode from my Road to Minecraft 113 commands and today's command is one uh, that hasn't changed very much but uh, there are some functionalities that are different uh, in Minecraft 113. This is set block and we're gonna see um, some new options that have been added to this uh, new version and also uh, way I'm gonna show you how to use uh, some of the um, new block stats uh, and do things like the things I have behind me yeah can you guess what block that is it looks new right well it is something that we already know and I'm gonna show you how to do this we are going to use I'm gonna use this just a placeholder uh, to get the coordinates faster and uh, we're gonna use set block and in this coordinate and we're gonna use uh, this block which is now a new one sunflower so uh, as I mentioned before in the previous episode each um, most of the items and, and things uh, from different co colors and different different classes have now their own IDs. Uh, sunflower is one of them. And now we're gonna uh, use the states uh, of this. The states available are half. So with half you can choose uh, to use the lower and or upper uh, half of the sunflower. The lower is uh, this one. Let me close it. There we go. Is this one what you saw? Uh, or we can change it to upper. There we go. And that will be the the flower itself, basically. So you can make lower flowers, maybe with uh, rose bushes could work better let's try that actually set block this uh, rose bush perfect and um, let's use the the upper half there we go yeah it's a bit different and well this is how you can uh, handle things to have different um, options for you so for example and if we use this again as a placeholder set block and we can use the piston head here and we're gonna use some options it's gonna be facing uh, up and another option will be short through and there we have it and you have a table and on top of that you can place an item so this is something that you can probably use uh, for different other things so map makers can use uh, can use it for different other things now um, this is how set block used to uh, work now there are three options if you saw and uh, let's try with this one so set block and to this position this is a sign and uh, rotation the uh, sign has the state rotation let's change it to 10 and this is the thing um, there are three options here to use set block one will destroy the previous item and will create a new one uh, the second will as far as I checked, we'll set a block only if that space is available, meaning there's only air in there. There's no blocks in there. Okay. And the last one will replace something. If it's if you're specifying the same block, it's gonna replace something. In this case, I'm gonna replace the rotation only. The the uh, text will be the same meaning that I'm not replacing the entire block only replacing part of it or one of the, the states so I'm gonna use replace in this case and I'm gonna press enter 
and it turned the other way <laughs> and it's the same item and you can do that with things like signs or uh, heads so let's do that set block and this one this should be a player head and the uh, property is rotation and we're gonna change it to I don't know uh, five maybe and this should be replace and there we go that is how it works now if you use things like destroy let's try with this block let's set block and to this block let's change it to stone and uh, let's destroy uh, whatever was there and and now I get the item it is like I mined the thing and the item got destroyed and the, um, the item pops out and I have it now and it's replaced by whatever I uh, put into set block so those are the three options that you can now use okay so there is one more thing uh, set block also um, is able to um, set some NBT data and also is able to use the uh, new coordinates that are uh, locational local coordinates as they are called so let's try both things so let's use set block and you specify those local coordinates with the uh, exponential uh, uh, sign and the first one is going to be left if it's positive and right if the value is negative and the second one is the height in this case we're going to use 1.6 which is um, basically at your head uh, distance but we're gonna look down a little bit so it, it will uh, place something on the floor and the next one is forward if the value is, is positive it's gonna be forward and if the value is negative it's gonna uh, put a set of block behind me so in this case we're gonna put it two blocks from uh, oh, um, in front of me and the next thing is gonna be play your head I'm gonna try that and I'm gonna add rotation to it. Rotation is gonna be, uh, let's say one. It'll be from one to fifteen. There are sixteen rotations in total. Oh, say one. Okay. And then I'm gonna add NBT. So um, to use um, NBT or to set uh, skin, for example, for player head, you need extra extra type that is one and specify the name let's say Omni and uh, we're gonna uh, replace oh well I already did it. <laughs> I already pressed enter and here's Omni's head and it's in front of me the other property that uh, also will also set uh, and head is uh, owner and let's try that and uh, for some reason when you specify owner no you won't always have the same um, skin uh, the other way is with owner and uh, whole thing with IDs uh, like this one let me show you real quick I have it here so this one has player head rotation and owner uh, has this whole MBT that will uh, actually find the UUID and find the texture, etc. etc. This is for having lagless heads. I have uh, two videos about this if you want to know. I'm gonna link them uh, in the description or somewhere in the very end. And this should uh, do that. <laughs> it will set block and it will use the texture I specified uh, for this in this case this is links head and that is working uh, perfectly 
so this is all for now uh, let me know if you have any questions i'm gonna try to document all of this information uh, in my website maybe um that's gonna take a bit of time but i'm gonna try to make it as soon as possible so you have a source where you can check every time and in the meantime you have this video and you can ask me anything on the comment section if you have questions so i'll see you guys in the next episode bye